everyone. I'm going to make a Christmas mini and thought that I would share the whole thing from scratch with all of you guys. So the first thing I do is show you the paper bag. I'm using these paper bags from their, their Avon paper bags. They're really old skin so soft paper bags. But if you're looking for cheap paper bags, um, find yourself an Avon rep because they have at least five different sizes. They have really tiny ones and big ones and medium sized ones and they're fairly inexpensive. So these are the bags I'm using. They're about uh, the width is six inches and I'm going to cut the length to six inches so it'll be a six by six mini. So here's my paper bags and I just took the flap part and folded it right at the edge here and that makes it about six by six and I've got one I've got four. I'm only using four paper bags because there's a lot of the flaps are quite large, so those will work as pages too. Then I made the cover uh, front uh, out of chipboard, the front and back cover. I'm just gonna ins I'll put these paper bags in, and then I'll show you. Okay back cover here. So I make the chipboard um, a little longer, or the front and back cover a little longer than the actual paper bag. And then, let's see, so the first paper bag, I'll show this process too, but I'll just say it real quick, that the, the first paper bag, the flap is on the left, because the flap, I'm going to tape it to the inside cover. And then also the back one, the flap is on the right, and that will get glued on or taped on to the, the back cover. And then I cut out these strips, so I have three of these. I don't know what we're gonna, I'm going to call these. They're just binding strips that are the same width as the album, and then it's three inches this way, so it's six, six inches by three inches. I score it in the center at one and a half, and then I just fold them. And those will go on the inside, so I, I'll show this process too. It goes, one will go in there, one will go in between that, and one will go in here. And that sort of creates a sturdier binding. And then, so I'm going to stop there and get out my tape and tape this all together. Okay, so I'm going to take my front cover. And I've already got some score tape on my first paper bag. So I'm just going to take the rest of this tape top part off. And I'm going to glue it on the front. or tape it on the front. Okay, so now I'm going to tape my first binding strip and it's going to go in here. So let me just get that all taped up. So I have my first binding that I'm going to add to the paper bag. And I got score tape on this side. Just going to take it off. I'm going to get my next paper bag. Okay. Then I'm going to put some tape here and put down the next piece of binding. I think if you're planning on making a really thick mini, this is probably not the way to go. 
I don't want this to be a thick mini. At least I'm hoping it's not going to be a thick mini. Okay, so I'm going to put the last paper bag on. So I'm only using four paper bags in this mini. Uh, the first paper bag, the flap was attached to the front cover. And the last paper bag, the flap is going to be attached to the back cover. Okay, so now I've just I've got it all score taped. I'm just going to put the back cover on. And see, I whoops. I know there's um a piece of the chipboard missing, but I didn't want to waste this piece. So once I cover it with paper, and maybe I'll start putting some flowers here. You'll you'll never notice it. Okay, so so far here we go. I got lots of pages here. So now what I'm going to do is these flaps. I'm going to glue them all down. Well, there's not that many, but, oh, there's a few. So, I'll be back. Okay, so there's my mini. All my flaps are glued down. Next, and I also um, like to glue these together, too. So I'm just going to do, I've done all the, I've done all the bags. I'm just going to do this one last one. And there we go. Next I'm going to decorate it with papers and I'm going to use the memory box. It's called Mistletoe. They're six by six. And uh, no, actually I'm not going to do this. I'm not going to glue them down. I am going to, um, I'm going to paint on the outside first. So I'll get my paints and I'll be back. I'm going to paint my book now <clears throat> with uh, red. It's called Christmas Red. And this one is a metallic shade and brown. It's called, or it's called Brownie. And I'm just going to mix the two shades together. So I've got most of the book painted. I've done all around the edges of all the pages. But I thought I'd save the last page and share and do it with you guys. And this paint, um, the acrylic paint that I'm using here, the Christmas red, and I mixed it with the a brown metallic. Um, the reason I mixed it with the, the shimmer metallic is because of the shimmer in it. Um, I like, I love using glimmer mist. Um, I have a few. I don't have too many glimmer mists, but the reason I don't use glimmer mist too much is because I have, um, I'm right handed and I have really bad arthritis in this hand. So to take the glimmer mist and start pumping is really 
um, quite difficult for me. So the next best thing is paint with shimmer in it. I don't know if the camera picks up, will be picking up the shimmer in the paint, but it's quite nice. And look at me, I'm just a mess. Okay, almost done. Then I'm going to heat set it so it dries faster. Okay. Let's heat set it. My mini is finished. Well, almost finished. I haven't embellied it or anything like that, but the papers are on. Uh, so I did also painted the binding here. And this piece, not I haven't glued this on because I'm not sure what kind of closure I'm going to do yet. But I'll just flip, quickly flip through it. Isn't that nice, uh, cute birdie paper? Um, so lots of room here because it's six by six, lots of room to decorate. And there's the other two pages, and I have a flap here, which I'll probably make pockets and stick tags in here. And then this two-page spread and another flap. Oh, and in the lots of big envelopes here, or sorry, big pockets here to add lots of big tags and, and goodies inside. And that's pretty, really pretty paper. And that's really pretty too, huh? And that's it. And that's the back page. So that's it. 